Shady Graves live in the Sydney 125 big room. I know that time is of the utmost for you guys this afternoon. Uh, but I do have to ask you, I, I did, um, we'll call it light stalking. Oh. Light stalking. <laughs> Uh, via Twitter, so you have a, a small group that you follow, but a, a diverse group. Um, Taylor Swift on one end, Wu Tang Clan on the other end. A really funny. Uh, um, you had one job account that I, I love a lot. I don't know if you if you're a fan of that one. What's uh, what's up with the diversity there from from one end to the other? Are you a fan of just both of them and all types of music, or it's sort of a, a lazy. Uh... Lazy Twitter misunderstanding that I, I is that I, I enjoy it a lot. I, I'm fairly new to it. Um, I'm also I'm also really big on following Andrew WK. He keeps us alive a lot on the road. Actually, yeah. we, he gives great weather reports. I don't know if you've had the opportunity to see his weather. I reports. have. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's party. Yeah. You should party party. everywhere is a party. Yeah, no temperatures. <laughs> we had like a, we were having a really sad. Like, well, how are we supposed to do this today? So we all feel terrible. We're like, please, Andrew WK. He tweeted at him, like, help us party God, do your thing. And he was like, I believe in you and the power of party or something. And we just like, whoop, like, no. <laughs> you, it's it's like 200 followers, you should just have one. Mm. Just follow Andrew WK, and then every time you go onto Twitter, that's all you'll see. He's a genius. Yeah, so you're a genius. Me? Yes, you. Yes. No, not Andrew too, but you yeah. especially. We're, we're one and two. They're interchangeable. But I gotta follow T Swift and the Wu Tang Clan, though. It's a real issue. That's the triad right there. It's the. That's, the, That's fantastic. It's the secret to eternal life. It's a bunch of guys to know. Were you at the uh, Rock and Roll Hall of Fame a few days ago? We were at the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame yeah. a few days ago. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and it was absolutely insane. They, for some reason, they let us back into the the chamber, like the unreleased secret vault place. There's so, a secret vault? Yeah, it's more of a room, uh, but it's like temperature controlled and they have all this stuff that's like not on display. So we got to see a bunch of kind of grim stuff. We got we got to touch the jacket that Otis Redding died in. Oh. Oh. Yeah. That was a strange reaction. I know. And then uh, there's a bunch of like Jimi Hendrix's clown outfits, you know, like crazy patched together. <laughs> like super when you look at it you're like no one would ever wear that and then you see a photo of him in it and he looks like a you know, majestic beast and you're like that's impossible <laughs> but uh kurt cobain stuff we got to touch his sweater and um elvis's handguns right next to like prince's lace doilies and stuff and, Did you get to touch those too or? yeah the, the crown jewel was sticking my <laughs> they had the whole outfit that bruce springsteen wore on the cover of born in the usa like a hat the whole deal and both me and Pat were like, we're going to stick our hands in Bruce Springsteen's pants right now. And we're like, can we do this? Can we put our hands in there? Like, you have to wear gloves. And we're like, that's fine. So we both took photos like, oh. You know, like, Did they have gloves oh. ready? Yeah, they totally have gloves. Yeah. I'm missing out. Yeah. I said this five minutes ago, I'll say it again. I don't know how we go from that to another song, but you do have one more for us. We do. We do. So we're gonna, we're gonna play you. you a song we're working on called Where Boy Wants to Great. Shaky Graves. We'll see you on the two five figure one.